What's up everybody? It is Tuesday and day nine of my first round of Shift Shop. Um, week two, day two. So my workout today was Strength 35, which um, I think is probably gonna go down as one of my favorite workouts in our entire catalog. It was just a lot of fun. Um, I really had to push hard. Usually with like strength workouts, I don't get super sweaty, but this one I definitely did. Second. Okay, I'm back. Kids. Emily was afraid of the dark, so I had Abby turn the light on. Pretty simple solution. <laughs> Anyways, um, strength 35. It was. I was sweating, and normally, like, strength workouts, I sweat some, but not as much as, like, you know, like, in comparison to a cardio, but I was, like, fully drenched, like, a cardio workout. Um, anyways, though, what I really was focusing on today, even though um, with the strength workouts we aren't using the markers, um, I am starting to figure out what I want to put on my markers because Chris has asked that we put affirmations or, you know, like quotes, whatever, on the markers, so we're always looking at them. And I really suck at that sort of thing because I'm always afraid of messing it up. It's kind of that perfectionism. Um, so I haven't done anything yet. But today I did my home base marker and I did I am. That's backwards. <laughs> when I look at it, it's right ways on this video. It's backwards. Um, but Chris was saying in a video the other day about how I am are like some of the most powerful words because whatever you say after I am is so when you hold on just a second again okay back again um so whenever you're speaking whatever you say after I am that's what happens like you know um, it's kind of like where it's got where focus goes, energy flows. Um, it's just you are going to be drawn to that. You are going to manifest it. And so often um, we don't put positive things behind I am. Um, myself included, I definitely am guilty of this. Um, you know, you just have that negative self-talk. And you say things about yourself. Ow. Um, but that's something I'm really starting to focus on. Because I know inside me that I have a lot more. Um, but I need to actually bring that out. So even something as simple as like doing this workout. I mean it is, you know, kind of more of an athletic training. Like Chris actually trains athletes in real life um, and that's always something that I've told myself is I am not an athlete um, like I've played sports and I did fairly well but I never considered myself that great so I always told myself I'm not an athlete but now I'm telling myself I am an athlete you know like yeah maybe I'm not competing in actual sports or anything like that but I am that is the lifestyle I am trying to lead. So that's something I'm saying to myself now. I am an athlete. Another thing, like with my business, um, it can be hard sometimes. And I definitely can fall into negative self-talk with that. So I'm working on some affirmations, you know, just to, you know, put me, I guess, in the position where I want to be. I'm starting to ramble now because I'm getting tired. <laughs> but anyways, um, I will be working on my other markers and sharing those over the next couple of days. But I wanted to share that one because I think it's going to bring about some good things. And I'll be sharing some of my I am statements as well. Um, but yeah, so tomorrow is Wednesday. So I'll almost be halfway through week two, and I'll check in with you then. All right, have a good night. Bye.